Who's in the coolest school? It's the Lil Dippers. Dive in with us for some handy fish and tips. First, take off the outer packaging, but there's no need to remove the tape from the inner bag. Just dip your Lil Dipper into water and see it magically come to life. Hold the top of the bag steady with both hands and your fish will swim away. Off you go for a tail. If your little dipper is starting to slow down, it may mean the batteries are flat. Here's how to replace them. First, dry off the fish by patting with a clean cloth or paper towel. Then, open the battery compartment using a crosshead screwdriver. Then fit three new button cells in like this. Make sure they are facing the correct way. Fit the battery door securely before putting back into water. It's really important to prevent water from entering the battery compartment. Little dippers will fall asleep after 10 minutes. To wake them up, just take your fish out of the water and give the water sensors a pat dry. Put the fish back into the water and it will swim happily away. Don't forget to feed your fish. Take the feeder from the pack. Put the feeder to the side of a clear tank in front of your fish and watch it enjoy a treat. Here's the Lil Dipper's fish tank set. Lift out the inner card section and take out the clamshell, plants, instruction booklet, and feeder. Make a beautiful home for Unicorn C by fixing the plants firmly into the base of the tank like this. Fill the tank up to this line with clean water. Just like the single fish, you don't need to take off the tape. Just dip the shell into the tank and watch her swim away. No matter how pretty you make your Lil Dipper's aquarium, never mix with real aquatic life. Don't store the fish in water. Pat them dry after play. Try not to restrict the movement of the fish tail when in water. For the Lil Dipper's fish tank set, don't allow the water to stand for long periods of time. Thanks for watching and have lots of fun with your fishy friends.